So first things first, go to support.sodac.com and uh, check for tutorials for Sodac 1 and going straight forward to LoRa 1. Here you want to choose the sample, simple LoRa sketch. Just copy and paste it to your Arduino ID. Now we have copied the sketch in our Arduino IDE. Um, first thing we have to do is to define the device address because we are going to use activation by personalization method. The other one is a bit more complicated. So Andreas Spies uh, shows in his video how to register the device and how to get all these uh, keys. You have to open the account at the Things Network and he explains it very well. So I will skip this part and give you a link to his video. So this is the tutorial from Andreas Spies. I will put the link below in the description. After having done that, uh, we can see that uh, the application is pretty simple. There are setup methods which are calling the setup LoRa, which then calls the setup ABP method and makes an instance of the LoRa device. We are using um, spreading factor 9 by default. The main routine, the void loop, is then calling the method send package and uh, waiting for five seconds after each loop. So the send package is for forwarding the string uh, to our LoRa gateway. That is basically it. Once we have successfully uploaded our sketch to the Sodak One device, um, we can see the transmission and we can open the Things Network console so we can see the received packages uh, which were received over the gateway. Here we can see the signal strength the spreading factor and also the location of the gateway. In my case, it's a gateway at ETH Zurich, so it is close to my place where I live. It's about 10 kilometers um, sight line from here. Some additional thing I want to mention about the frame counter. Um, you can see that you have a link here to reset the frame counters. Uh, if you reboot your device, you always have to reset the frame counter. counter uh, but there is a the way to avoid that. You can just disable this checkbox. So all the packages uh, will be received after you reboot your device.